Cloudy, what is it? Um, Mommy, can I have lunch? Cloudy, darling, you just had breakfast five minutes ago. Oh, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> <sighs> I'm so bored. Ooh, pretty butterflies. Cloudy, darling, if you're bored, why don't you... Cloudy? Cloudy? Cloudy, where'd you go? Cloudy? Oh no! West! Please, West, we have to find him. He's still missing. I, I don't know what happened. I was just grazing and then all of a sudden he's gone and I don't know where he went. Just calm down, Flora. Try your best to take it easy. Take deep breaths. We are going to do our very, very best we can to find your foal. Thank you. We have to find him. I've just covered all the north side of our territories and he's not there. Oh, I can't believe this is happening. Flora, are you okay? Yes, I just, I want my full bag. I don't know where he could have gone. Don't worry, Flora, we're going to find him. West is right, everything's going to be okay. I know, but what if he gets mixed up in another herd and gets, and gets hurt or worse yet, predators? <sighs> Flora, I know you're worried, but he's a tough colt. We've taught him a lot of things. I think he'll be able to survive until we find him. <sighs> I know. Come on, Flora, let's go look some more. We still gotta cover the south side of our territory. Can't believe this. Mare's just grazing and all of a sudden she turns around and her foal's gone. Oh well, either way, I'll find him. Sounds pretty weird, am I right? Uh, what am I doing talking to myself? I gotta find Flora's colt so she'll quit worrying and I can get home. Butterflies! Aw, come back, butterflies! Oh well, it's fun while they wanted to play. Huh, I'm hungry. Uh, Mommy? Mom? West? Anybody? Huh? Help? Oh no, I think I'm lost! I I've got to get home and find Mommy! Sir, we're just reporting back. We haven't found any signs of the colt yet. I certainly hope Ice is having better luck than we are. Me too. I, I just don't understand where a little colt could go in a few hours. <sighs> Me neither, West. Ugh. 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 Oh boy, finally made it to the top. Kurt, who is that? Who knows? Huh? Hey, there's horses up there. Hey, you guys up there. I don't know if you know this or not, but you're trespassing on the Western Herd's territory. Oh, Kurt, you didn't tell me we were trespassing. I didn't know. Hey, look, buddy, what if we don't want to move? Oh, never mind him, whoever you are. We're leaving now in peace. Thank you for letting us know whose territory this was. Come on, Kurt. Hm. All right, well, at least there was no fighting involved in that. All right, now we're going to continue to look for Cloudy.
Cloudy, are you here? <sighs> Just gotta keep going. Ugh, this forest is so thick. Ugh, great, more intruders. Don't worry, Ice, it's only me. West, I thought you were another intruder. I ran into a mare and stallion over on the mountainside. The mare was nice and they left in peace, but the stallion was a bit rude. I'm glad there was no fighting, but now to get down to the important thing, have you found any signs of the cult? I'm sorry, sir. I've been looking high and low, but I haven't even found a hoof print that looks like his. Well, we shall keep looking until we do. How about for the rest of today's search, me and you team up and look in the valleys? Sounds like a plan, sir. Flora, I think we should head back now. It's getting dark and we won't be able to track very well in the night. Um, okay, sure. Uh... Are you sure we can't track just for a little farther? Flora, it's getting dark. We best go back. Okay, I'm sure Wes will have us out first thing in the morning. Of course. And don't worry, Flora, we're going to find your foal. I know. I just want him to be safe. And I miss him, and... <sighs> Come on, Starlight, let's go. Gee, why do these woods have to be so creepy? I wish I was with Mommy. And speaking of Mommy, I'm hungry. Guess I could eat some of this grass, but I'm more tired than I am hungry. I think I'm just going to go to sleep here. <laughs> <gasps> what was that? Oh, I really wish I was home. We're going to find him. I'm going to get some sleep. I'm talking to myself. I miss Cloudy so much, I'm talking to myself. We've got to find him. Take it easy, Flora. Get some sleep. It's dark and it's late. We'll start out very early in the morning. Okay, West. Sounds good. been dreaming. Kurt, I can't believe how rude you were to that horse we ran into yesterday. Well, if you weren't so nice... Wait a minute. Did you hear that? No. What was it? It sounded like a little horse or something. Hey, there it is again. Come on, let's go find out. talking. Maybe they can help me. Esther, look, I found it. Oh, Kurt, look, it's just a baby. Come here, little guy, over here. Huh? Oh, hi. Um, could you maybe help me? I'm sort of lost, and I can't find my way back home. 
Oh, Kurt, you hear that? The poor baby's lost. Oh, boy. Come here, sweetie. Come to Mama. Um, you don't look like my Mama. Oh, Kurt, he's so cute. We have to help him get home. I know, I know, but seriously, Esther, we really don't have time for this. And what are we supposed to do? Just leave him here? Absolutely not. But we don't even know where he lives, and there's no way of finding out. Kurt, why don't we ask him? Oh, okay. Oh, goody, goody, goody. Now, little fella, you tell Nanny where you live. Uh, I live in a herd. Oh, you hear that, Kurt? He lives in a herd. Now, where's your herd located? Well, I don't know. The herd's always moving to different feeding grounds. Okay, um, what's your mommy's name? Mommy. No, no, I mean, what does your daddy call your mommy? Um, I don't know. My daddy passed away before I was born. Oh, I'm sorry to hear. Um, how long have you been lost? Since about yesterday morning. Oh, you poor darling had to spend the whole night by yourself in the creepy woods. You're so brave. I could never do that without Kurt. Oh, well, that's nice. Well, Kurt, it looks like I got all the information we needed. Let's take the little guy home. But, Esther, you don't even know his name. Oh, that's true. Well, how about, um, maybe Mondance or Thunder or maybe Whirlwind or how about Kurt after you, Kurt? How about Cloudy? Oh, I guess that name will do for now. Come on, everybody, let's take little Cloudy home. Flora, I believe I'll climb this hill just to see if I can't sight him below. Okay, sure. I'll look down here a little bit. Well, I don't see too much here. Aw, look at these little hoof prints. They look just like Cloudy's. Wow, there's quite a few of them here. Oh, and over here, there's some, looks like bigger hoof prints, like adult horses. And this here looks like gray and white fur. Cloudy has gray and white fur. And there's a whole bunch of it here as well. Like, maybe a small gray and white horse might have slept here last night. Oh, I do hope it was Cloudy. I have to go get ice. Please come quickly. I found some hair. You found some hair? Well, it, it's not like that. It, it's just that it's gray and white hair, and there's a whole bunch of hoof prints. I mean, little hoof prints around it, and, and it looks like a, maybe a small horse might have slept in this area um, one night, and you just got to come see it, Ice. Okay, Flora, calm down. Let's go check it out. You see ice where all these little gray and white hairs are stuck to the ground, just as if Cloudy had slept here. I see, but like you said, there's also a lot of hoof prints around here. Like, some are Cloudy-sized, but others are sort of like adult horse-sized. So it's obvious if Cloudy was here, it means he had company. Oh, ice, is, is that a good thing? Well... If they're nice in helping him get home, yes, it's great. But if they're not friendly, then, well, you know, it can be trouble. Oh, Ice, we, we have to follow these hoof prints and find out where they lead to. Exactly. Come on, let's go. Now, Cloudy, when you were wandering from home, do you ever remember passing through this area? Um, no. Uh, are you sure? Like, you don't remember this stick or that tree or anything around here? Are you absolutely positive, Cloudy? Yes, I'm sure. I've never been here before. Oh, oh. It is so hot out. Kurt, Cloudy, do you mind if we take a break here? My hooves are killing me. Yes, of course, Esther.
Oh, thank goodness. Here's some shade. Um, I'm not that hot. Can I go have a snack? Of course, go have a great big snack. Um, okay, thank you. Oh, Kurt, get in here and have some shade. It's so hot. Okay, yeah, well, maybe while we're both standing here in the shade, I can talk to you. Esther, we have no clue where this fool's herd is. We could spend the rest of our life trying to look for them. Well, I, I do have to admit, Kurt, it is turning out to be a little hotter than I expected. But we can't give up. I know that. I just can't believe this fool doesn't remember anything about his herd. Oh, Kurt, he's just little. I know, but if we just knew his herd name or something, we'd be able to find them easier. What's my herd's name? What's my herd's name? It's, it's something named after my, uh, our lead stallion, uh, West, uh, the Western Herd. My herd's name, it's the Western Herd. Oh, Cloudy Darling, are you sure? Yes, yes, it's the Western Herd. It's named after our lead stallion, West. And, and it's in the Western Territories. And, and I just don't know how to get there. The Western Herd. Huh. Hey, uh, Colt, do you want to run and finish your snack? Okay, but we're going there, right? Of course. Let's just let Esther cool off a little longer. I'm so excited we're going home. Hey, Esther, remember that dude we ran into the other day? You know, the one that kicked us off of his turf? Oh, yes, the one you were so rude to. Yeah, well, he was from the Western Herd, remember? Oh, yes, th that's right. Right. Well, remember what the kid said, Esther? They're a traveling herd, and they have a huge territory. So that means this herd is going to be pretty hard to find. Oh, Kurt, how big can it actually be? I'm sure we'll have the little guy home safe and sound before it's dark out. Okay, Esther, we better get a start on it then. Cloudy darling, it's time to get started again. Now that we know your family lives in the Western Territories, they'll be much easier to find. Oh boy, I can't wait to see Mommy and West and the, and the rest of the herd again. Okay, well let's get going, sweetie. Come on, Kurt. Ice, how do you know these are the same set of tracks that we've seen earlier? <laughs> I don't know. I guess I just know. Well, I'm so glad that you're so talented with knowing how to track because I have the slightest clue. Now, let's keep going and see if we can't find Cloudy and whoever these horses are he's with. All right, Flora, you're the boss. But you're right. It would be wonderful to find Cloudy. Boy, are you telling me. Come on, let's keep going. What do you see, Ice? Nothing. It's just that the tracks get a little scrambled here, as if the party were after took a break or stopped here for something. They also look really, really fresh. Oh, Ice, please, let us keep going. Maybe we can find Cloudy before it gets dark. Well, it looks like the tracks head out into the woods again, so we'll just continue following them. Good, let's get started. Do you see him anywhere, sir? No, hopefully Ice and Flora will report with better luck tonight. Gee, I can't wait to see my herd again. I've missed them a ton. I didn't know I liked them so much, especially Mommy. And, of course, I miss Wes, too. He's our herd stallion. Did you know he's a full-blood Mustang? When I grow up, I want to be just like him. And then, of course, there's my very much older than me sister, Starlight. She spends most of her time doing other things, but she's still my sister, and I love her. Gee, I can't wait to see them again. Did you know there's five members in my herd? 
Oh, and then there's Ice. He's just like West. He is so brave. I'm not related to him anyway, but he's still a member of the herd. Oh, Kurt, ain't he just so adorable? So, what about you guys? Who's in your herd? Well, uh, you see here, little Cloudy, uh, me and Esther don't really belong to her herd. We just sort of roam the plains by ourselves and do our best to stay off of other herds' territories, and who knows, maybe someday we might join a herd or something, but for now, we just kind of go from place to place. Gee, you don't have a family or anything? Hey, you should join my herd, the Western herd. Well, I don't know, Cloudy. We'd have to get permission and everything and other things, but that's very kind of you to say. Okay, well, you'd like my herd. I'm sure we would, Cloudy. They all sound so nice. Oh no, Flora, look at that sky. Oh, Ice, you don't think it's going to storm, is it? It could. Oh, but Ice, maybe it'll just go around us. No, Flora, it's headed our direction. We best go back. Besides, we have to report back to the herd at dark. Okay, Ice, if you insist. Oh no! Everybody, did you hear that? Oh, oh no, I think it's going to storm. You're right, Esther, it is going to storm. Oh my, oh, oh, oh dear, Kurt, I I'm scared. No, oh, don't be scared, Esther, but we best take shelter. We passed the cave back there a little ways. Um, we could use it. Good thinking, Cloudy, let's go. Oh dear. Come on, Cloudy, run a little faster. Okay, I'll try. Please, don't run so fast. Kurt, do you hear me? I've been talking to you. <gasps> oh, 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 please help. Oh, Kurt, Kurt, my leg is stuck. Huh? <gasps> oh no, Esther. Esther, are you okay? Are you in pain? Well, only when I try to move it. Uh, can't you pull it out, Esther? No, it can't. It's stuck, Kurt. It's stuck. Cloudy, you go to the cave. I'm going to stay here and help Esther get her leg out of this hole. Then we'll be right behind you. Uh, okay. Okay, Esther, does it hurt when I do this? Oh, that hurts, Kurt. Don't do that. Uh, oh, boy. Nice to watch the storm go by. Yeah, especially when I'm not getting wet. West, I'm worried about Cloudy. It's really storming out there. Flora, I understand you're worried, but I'm sure Cloudy's somewhere in a nice warm cave. Oh, oh no! Huh? Which way was the cave? West, no. I have a feeling I know Cloudy is somewhere out in that storm, and I'm going to go look for him. I won't let you. It's pouring down rain and it's thundering. I understand your concern, West, but you can't stop me. I'm going. <sighs> Ice, go after her and bring her back. Uh, yes, of course, sir. Esther, we've got to get it out. Here, let me try again. <laughs> Cloudy! Cloudy! Cloudy, are you here anywhere? Uh, 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 I can't get out. I'm stuck in these thick bushes. Uh, help! Help! I'm stuck! Anybody! 
there is again, and it's coming from these bushes. <laughs> I want to be home. <gasps> oh my goodness, Cloudy! <gasps> Mom? Oh, Cloudy, my baby, are you okay? I'm okay, Mom, just get me out. Okay, Cloudy, hang on, Mama's going to get you out. Oh, my darling. Come on, sweetie, let's hurry up and get back to the cave. No, Mommy, wait. Kurt and Esther, my friends, they've been helping me get home. They're, they're out there and they're stuck. Esther, her, her leg is stuck in a hole. We have to help them, Mommy. Oh, okay, Cloudy. It hurts, it hurts, it hurts. Oh, Esther, I don't know what to do. Hi, um, I'm Flora, Cloudy's mom. Um, Cloudy told me what happened. Is everything going okay and do you need some help? Well, everything is not going okay and we could use some help. Um, honey, I'm not sure what your name is, but this might be a bit painful. <gasps> what are you gonna do? We're gonna all work together and get your leg out. Uh, come on, everybody, we can pull it out. Oh, there, it's out. Oh, oh, wonderful, thank you all so much. Oh, it feels so good. No problem. Now let's go back to our cave where our herd is. Flora? <gasps> Cloudy! Hi, Ice, did you miss me while I was gone? Are you kidding? You bet. Hey, what are those two horses doing here? Oh, Ice, they were helping me find my way home. Oh, Cloudy, I can't wait to hear all about it. But let's go back to the herd where it's safe. It's getting dark out fast. Okay, Mommy, come on, everyone. Oh, Cloudy, I am so happy we finally found you. You had me so scared while you were gone. Thank goodness you're back home safe and sound. Me too, Mommy, I missed you. I missed you too, Cloudy. But you have to promise me that you will never, ever, ever wander away from the herd again until you are older. Yes, Mommy, I promise. I'm sorry. That's a good boy. Now when you grow up to be big and strong like West and Ice, then you can go out and explore the world. Okay, Mommy. Oh, by the way, can we have breakfast now? Oh, Kurt, they're just so beautiful together. I think I'm going to cry. Oh, Esther, please don't start. Hey, uh, we just want to thank you guys for all your help in bringing Cloudy back to Flora. Uh, we all really, really appreciate it. And show our thanks. Me and West agreed that it would be perfectly fine for you to come onto our territories whenever you want and do whatever you want. Wow, thanks. Oh, this herd is so beautiful. I don't want to leave, but Kurt, don't you think we ought to get going? Esther's right. We should probably get a move on it. No, wait! Please let them join our herd, Wes. They're lonely, and, and they just kind of wander on the plains, and they're lost. Well, I don't know. Would you like to stay with our herd? Would I like to stay? Of course, I'd love to. That is, of course, if it's okay by you. Good, then it's settled. We'll stay. Wonderful. Yes, hooray, they're going to stay with us. Mommy, they're gonna stay with the herd. Welcome to the herd, Curtin Esther. Oh, so you're Starlight, Cloudy's older sister. He told me all about you. Yes, well, you see, me and Cloudy aren't really related. We get along pretty good, and Cloudy's quite young, so he just calls me his older sister. Oh, that is so adorable. You know, that reminds me of a story I once heard. Would you like me to tell it to you? It's kind of like just like a little story of these two wild horses. Anyway, it's really good. I heard it back in Britain when I was over there as a racehorse. Not really a racehorse, but you know, like a dressage horse. But then I went wild and it came over. And it's just a great story. By the way, I love your mane. Oh, thank you. You really like it? Yours is nice, too. Now, let me ask you, how do you get it all to lay on one side? Ah, mare talk. 
So, your name is Ice? Yeah, Ice. Um, welcome to the herd, by the way. Thanks. Well, Claudia, it looks like your friends are getting along with the herd pretty good. Hey, why don't we go over here and graze a little bit, okay? Okay, Mommy. Hey, Mom. I want to go over there and explore that rock. I'll be right back. Oh, no you don't. I'm coming with you. Okay, Mommy, that's a good idea, because the next time I get lost and go on an adventure, I want you to be with me. <laughs> Come on, silly cloud. Thank you.